Okay, it seems we're recording, so let me begin. Um, so, hello students, my name is Dylan Geithner, I'm your professor for this class, and in this brief video, I'm going to just briefly address the reason why we do ethics. So, let me just make a quick observation. Now, ethics is a subset of philosophy, and there are, are probably as many definitions as of philosophy as there are philosophers. But one of my favorite and one of the more standard definitions is that philosophy is the attempt to address important questions about life that are not amenable to empirical investigation by use of reason. Now, uh, and in the er specific instance of ethics, then what we're trying to figure out by use of reason primarily, although, um, I think intuition also has a, has a role to play, and I'll get back to that eventually. Uh, but uh, the point of ethics is to try to address problems about, or questions about correct moral conduct, or correct behavior, I should say, um, by use of reason, instead of trying to just determine what is correct moral conduct by dint of received authority. In fact, technically, that's the distinction between ethics and morals. Morals is received authority. The Ten Commandments is normative uh, morals. It's just setting out norms that you should or should not behave by. But what if you have a conflict between two different norms? You know, what if honoring your mother and father requires you to give false witness? Is it moral to perjure yourself and on stand to protect your parents, for example? Uh, that's where there's a problem with just morals, because if you have a conflict between the two different duties, how do you resolve it? How do you balance it? Ethics tries to address these kind of questions, but it does so through use of reason. Also, as I mentioned, a little bit of intuition as well, but mostly reason. Um, also, let me just point out that part of the reason why I personally specialize in ethics, even though my background is in philosophy in general and in the study of world religions, is because we human beings are social creatures and as such, ethical conflicts and tensions are inevitable. Because we're social creatures, we're always, we, each of us have roles of our own, our own values, our own priorities, and sometimes they come in conflict. Um, that would not be the case if we were truly solitary creatures. Now, ethical issues arise all the time, not just in the dusty pages of ethics theoreticians, but also in current affairs, and which we will be addressing in the course of the class. And moreover, in our popular entertainment, in the political sphere, and in our personal lives. And since we're all of us doing ethics all the time, although are we doing it consciously or at a subconscious or an emotive level, much of ethics as a school of philosophy is theoretical and we will be giving you some background on the theory of ethics in this class. But unlike some areas of philosophy, it needs must by its very nature be applicable as well, which is why I prefer it. Uh, epistemology, metaphysics, uh, teleology, all these are schools of philosophy, but a lot of them are very abstract and not directly applicable. Ethics, by its very nature, has to be applicable. And the more we internalize the theories of ethics, the more we can understand ethical issues in our own daily lives and apply those theories to making decisions that are reasonable, rational, internally consistent and just. So that's why we do ethics. It's a fascinating subject. I've devoted a large part of my life to the study of ethics and it has informed and uh, assisted me in dealing with a lot of the issues in my life, but also appreciating the world we have around us, what's going on in the sphere of politics, what occurs in our popular fiction. It's ethics is um, embedded in every part of our lives as social creatures. And I hope by the end of this class, you'll see the same thing as well. So 
just a quick, quick thought. We have evenings together. I hope you all I'll find this class thoughtful, intelligent, engaging, and rewarding. Ciao.